Okay. Here we go. We always start off parts like crap, don't we? Um, maybe. <laughs> you cut out. I still heard you, though. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, pretty much in this part, we're going to do nothing much special for five minutes because we're just going to go get some more stuff, and then she healed me with poison thingy. But anyways, um... Yay. Well, that was the most crappy <laughs> game I've heard. Pretty much we're going to <laughs> underground place next, which is where my sound has trouble soon. You'll see. Uh, Cloth cape. Yeah, an item that I could have probably used a long time ago. With now, it's like the most—it's really useless. Yeah, it certainly sounds like it. Yeah, I know it's made of cloth. What do you expect? Then again, not I'm much. Else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought all cloth—I mean, capes were made of cloth. <laughs> See, that's useful. Yeah, it certainly looks like it. I recognize this room. Yes, it's where that. Well, oh, shit, that was weird. Where that boss was. You remember? Yes. The twin battle thing. With the winged guy and the guy that looks like a crow. Uh-huh. Wait, what did you call the other one? Oh, yeah. Looks like a crow. Are you, wait, are you talking about the flying one or the one on the ground? The one on the ground. How did that look like a crow? Just the beak? Yeah, the beak and stuff. Ah. Uh, you're probably wondering where are we the going? That doesn't work. The wolf nah, it doesn't look like it. The wolf is too weak. Uh huh. You're probably wondering where we're we going. I told you we're going to exactly. the caverns. <laughs> they are this way, anyways, so we're going the right way. Yay! Also, need to find the stopwatch. I think I do find the stopwatch before I get to the clock place. Oh, yeah. I know this room. Uh huh. This is where the. You remember how I hit that switch and I said we had to go there later? Yeah. Guess what? It's later. Yay! <laughs> Let's kill those scorpion things, wherever they are. Actually, we don't have to go that way. Really? Yeah. Plus, I thought they were called no. Diplo something. Weren't they called, like, Diplo something? Diplo Cephalus? Yeah. How the fuck do you remember the last part? Medical terminology. <laughs> it gets to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much, we don't have the clock, so before we go to the... <laughs> I nailed it. Um, before we go to the... Uh, yeah, cave thingy, we are going to go get the clock uh, sub-weapon, that stupid... Yay! It... He jumped into it! I know, he cooked himself. Fleeman's like, ha, ah, I hurt... Ah! <laughs> Pretty much... Uh, What's that? It's a thing where... You... At first, I forgot how to do it, but you push left, right, and attack, or right, left, and attack, and the little thing shoots out. I never actually figured out what it does. I know I've... Right. I don't know. Someone probably knows. I just never paid attention, because you can only do it with the shield rod. Ah. Most weapons have some kind of weird um, special ability you could use with them. I think the clock's right here. Isn't it? Yay. Uh, right here. Right there. There we go. Now we got to go back! Yay. I actually was thinking about speeding up this portion, but I'm like, you know what? No, people can listen to us. Yeah, you love hearing our voices. Well, it seems some people have. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta, I gotta really, I gotta bring up that comment because that made me laugh. Um, someone, <laughs> Julie, a fat emo kid. You know, the funny thing is, she's actually the complete opposite of that. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think technically, if you want to call anyone the fat emo kid, you call me it. But then again, I'm not emo. I'm just. <laughs> okay. Pretty much, yeah, we use that, and now we... Yeah. Oh, shush. Alucard shield. They're actually... In the beginning of the game, the things at Death Star were the Alucard. Duh, duh, not T. T, they're actually fake versions of the other things, but they actually have a special ability I never knew about until, like, a day ago when I look it up. If you equip all three things, which I don't do, uh, besides the fact that they're weak and shit, it also increases your luck by, like, 30% or something good. Sweet. Eh, it's not really that useful, but I read that. Eh. Okay, now we're, gonna, now we're going to go into the cave. Huh. Yay, cavern. Yeah, cavern thingy. And it's almost five minutes. I told you it was around five minutes. Yes. What did you uh, What did you say when I was... Uh, fuck, I don't remember now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Gosh. I'm confused. It's fine. No, it's not. Cloud seems more calm and actually laughs when he's doing narration with other people. We like that. Well, good, because I'm not 
Having to act like a screaming retard every five seconds. <laughs> People <laughs> seem to like that when you uh, act uh, panicky and stuff, right? No, they don't seem to. They do. <laughs> and here we are. Somewhere different. <laughs> Spear guards. I stared at the And you're going to save. Yes, and then we're going to go left and get something to come back and go fight the optional ball. Okay, I guess I should explain this really fast. Um, To get to the inverted castle, meaning the other 100% of the game, you have to get these two items. The gold ring and the silver ring. The, the silver ring is found in this area after we get this armor later, which we can't get. But the gold ring is found after beating the optional succubus boss, which is like to the... Well, there's a secret area. To um, the succubus boss, which is going to be in the next three minutes. Sweet. I guess you could say it's optional. Then again, if you don't... Pretty much, if you don't get the two rings and go to the clock tower and get this thing, when you fight Richter in the end, if you kill him, you'll get the bad ending. If you equip the thing you get from the two rings, you could kill the other thing and go to the other 100% of the game. <laughs> Plus, Richter's really painful. He actually almost kills me when I'm trying to attack the thing that's controlling him later. I'm just like, oh my god! He is a vampire slayer, after all. Uh-huh, his thing really hurts like hell. Plus, I didn't have any certain art. Well, I'll explain it later when I get it. I don't I don't got it yet, so I don't want to explain it. Okay. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah, Succubus Chick is this way. We're almost there. Claymore. Do-do-do. I like the music still. I always check the things, but they're always usually shitty. Ah, gotcha. Speak up, fool. Oh, I'll speak up, all right. No, you won't. <laughs> no. no, no, you won't. Uh, a, what, what, are, what are those? I explained what they were a long time ago. I forget. They're, they just ran... I'm about to use them all, actually. They randomly spawn a random food item for you could use later. Also, this is a lot better than any of the other crap I have. Moonstone. Moonstone actually has a use. Unlike the Zircon and stuff, those are known for selling. See, we're going to equip the meal cards and use them for no reason now. And the save point, Yay. which is this way. Woo! Woot. <laughs> Omelette. <laughs> pizza! Mike, <My>, what? <laughs> what? What's freaking pizza existing in a place like this? Because even Dracula needs orders of pizza. Come on. <laughs> yeah, the succubus is in the most obvious trap ever. Let's see. You know what a save point looks like. I was trying to remember something. Okay. Right. Here we go. Whenever I... Whoa. I was trying to remember how to do that. Right. Right here. Julie got What's quiet. What's going to happen? Nothing. Oh, glowy. Oh, it's a black screen. Nightmare, eh? Uh-huh. It's only... This is the only thing in here is you fight the succubus. Oh, dear. She's pretending to be his mom to trick him into something. Ah. She fails. This happened in his past blog. Yeah. Mother! Mama's boy! <laughs> okay, Sephiroth. This is the only part she switches. She actually tells him to love humans. So that's ah. a big thing. <laughs> no! I'm gonna kick your ass. She's like, uh-oh, I'm busted. <laughs> Reveal thyself! Exactly. She sucks bad, in a bad way. <laughs> well, she sucks in multiple ways, but that's because she's that. <laughs> Hush. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. She's really easy. Also, it's kind of funny... 
I don't let her do her one thing where she, um, stand there. She has this one thing where she goes into a bunch of different forms and you have to pick the real one. Funny thing is, she doesn't even last, like, 30 seconds. Because <laughs> she sucks in a bad way. I didn't know you could glitch her <laughs> by doing that. Ah, oh, uh, gotcha. Late. And she's dead. Yeah, for beating her, you get one of the two rings you need. She gets it now. <laughs> and now you're dead! And here comes the wrong sounding thing. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, and to then you go back out here, and the ring's over there, and now it's all for now. And we're, all, we're out of time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.